Okay. In the continuing saga of uh, Model A Ignition 101, uh, I was playing with the car the other day and we thought the coil was no good because I couldn't get a spark out of it. And I'll show you what I did that led me astray. Uh, I've got a battery charger here, so that's my power supply. This is a ground, that's, that'll be the car. And I've got positive ground to the vise. And I've got uh, the negative to the coil. And if I touch this, that energizes the coil. But I get no spark here. So that's kind of stupid. And we concluded, well, that coil must be bad. That's not the case at all. Uh, the clue here is you have to have a condenser in the uh, circuit. So now I have a condenser that's grounded. Now this has to connect to the uh, positive terminal on the coil, and that's how it does in the car. And if I connect that to that, and now I put power to this, I get a good spark. Okay, so I think that is a method of checking the coil and the condenser. If you've got a condenser, and I always said they don't go bad, but, but they do, uh, you, you can check that with, uh, with a coil, putting power to, uh, uh, power to the coil, the negative side, the hot one, and then what this does this goes this terminal goes up to your ignition switch back down to here back down to the points and they ground this circuit and that's what I'm doing when I touch this to the to the vice I'm simply acting as the points so I hope this explains a, it some to some degree all right as a review uh, this is the setup you need. You can do it with the battery on the car or you can use a um, battery charger as I did, some power supply. And the positive is grounded. I grounded uh, mine to the vise or you can ground this to the car frame or whatever. Then uh, the uh, negative terminal goes up to the negative terminal on the coil. That you can leave alone. Then uh, this terminal, the positive terminal on the coil, that has to hit ground and then break in order to cause the spark. So here's uh, points, or I was just touching this terminal to the vise to act as the points. And then the condenser has to go somewhere in this circuit to ground. And uh, in the distributor, it's hooked uh, near the points to ground. You can also hook it to this terminal to ground, but you need a condenser. Then once you get that, you make this circuit, and that charges a coil. And then when this circuit is broken, the coil field collapses, and that fires the spark from the center terminal on the coil to ground. And in this case, my coil wire was sparking to the vise.